Hello, G traders. You're watching Daily Currency Market News on Insta Forex TV channel with me, Kate Nidachina. The solid used dollar fell in value on Tuesday because investors said about buying up the euro, which has been under pressure for long due to expectations of a soft monetary policy in the eurozone. In the early session, the euro rose against the used dollar and was trading at the level of 1.618. The single European currency gained ground in light of Germany's strong manufacturing PMI. However, later today the euro dropped again due to PMIs from other eurozone countries. The euro dollar pay is currently trading at the level of 1.597 with an effort to break out upward. The pay is being supported by some positive macroeconomic data. So Germany has set the tone for the euro's dynamic. The largest economy in the eurozone released the final manufacturing PMI report and the unemployment exchange data for November. Germany's manufacturing PMI posted expansion to 52.9 points in November, exceeding the flash estimate of 52.6 points. The indicator looked to 52.1 in October. Likewise, the unemployment change report showed positive scores. The Federal Labor Agency reported that the seasonally adjusted number of people out of work declined by 6.3% or 13,000 in November, bigger than the expected decrease of 5,000. PMI readings posted in expansion territory in almost all of the Eurozone countries. So Germany, Italy and Spain revealed upbeat results. On the contrary, business activities in France's and Switzerland's manufacturing sectors contracted. On the whole, the Eurozone manufacturing upturn gained further momentum. However, this data will hardly make the ECB reconsider its decision to soften the monetary policy and cut interest rates, thus pushing the euro down. Nevertheless, many analysts expect the single European currency to grow to the target level of 1.06 today. It was InstaForex News and me, Kate Nidachina. Have a nice trading day!